Hello, my name is Nolan. I'm inside the Stand On Liquid Warehouse. I'm going to be doing a stand-up paddleboard review of the 12-foot, 6-inch, and 14-foot Zephyr by Tahoe SUP. Tahoe is really known for high-end boards, inlaid bamboo, very good board weight to construction ratio. This is a 14-foot board here in the blue version, also available in the 12-6 Ivory. So these boards in either length are available in either color. Gives you some options, gives you some flexibility if you have a preference. Both boards have this inlaid wood here. It's a really sharp caramel bamboo color that's sure to hold up over a long period of time. Going to start at the nose of the board. The displacement on this 14 foot paddle board is going to really allow the board to go through conditions going to track really well, meaning you can paddle up to a dozen, potentially 15 times per side without the board moving. Really efficient way to paddle. Has a self-vent plug here on the deck. Both boards are going to be the same setup, just a different length. Into a set of tie downs here with a really simplistic graphic. The board dips down in the standing area. The closer you can get to the water, the more stable the board's going to be for you. So if you notice this little dip, and it actually comes back up on the other side. So you're going to be extremely close to the water. For this board being 29 and a half inches wide, that's going to be really key to pick up that stability. A nice handle for transport right here. This handle is going to allow you to pick it on and off the car a lot more efficiently, opposed to a recessed, more cubby style handle. Nice uniform matte deck pad, great for long distance paddling. It's going to be cushy on your feet for the distances, hours that you're on the board. A second vent plug, this is great what Tahoe did. So this is gonna allow this longer board to vent more efficiently over an extended period of time. There's another set of tie downs on the back of the board on both the 14 foot and 12 foot six inch paddle board. This is a really functional space. I'm going to preview two accessories that are exclusive to Tahoe. This is the Buddy Pad. It's a Velcro pad, non-slip. It's going to allow your dog, your passenger, anything that you want to put on this to stay on the board and not scuff up this beautiful board. Velcro. Into the back of the tail, Tahoe Paddle Board. These buttons are significant to Tahoe. It's a really good indicator of what type of board you're riding. Has a leash plug here on the back as well. The other accessory that I'm a big fan of is the Tahoe Sup Sup Pack. This is a backpack that will actually clip into these grommets that are on the front and the back of the board. It's water resistant, a good way to store your camera, flip flops, any gear that you're going to use for the paddle. The bottom of the board has a really unique shape as well. Really clean, this white's not going to absorb the heat like a darker red or black board. It has a single concave to it, which is a subtle V. It almost acts like a rudder throughout the board that's going to ensure, in combination with the displacement on the nose, it's going to track really well. Both in the 12 foot 6 inch and 14 foot version, it's a single 10 inch oversized fin. This is an ideal board for a bigger paddler. The 14 foot will have a capacity up to 280 pounds. The 12 foot 6 inch version is up to 250 pounds. If you're looking for a classic board that's going to last for years and years, something you can be proud of, buy right the first time, this should be in the running for your dollars. Again, this is Nolan with Stand On Liquid doing a stand-up paddleboard review of the Tahoe Zephyr by Tahoe Sup.